Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Today we will be doing a Lay's chip tier list. Literally every single day, someone would message me telling me that we should do a Lay's tier list. Really? No, I'm just trying to build hype here. I love Lay's. I've been looking forward to this one. That makes sense, seeing as how you yourself are a f***ing potato. Let's just get started. Where are we putting sour cream and onion? Sour cream and onion is an all-time classic. Kids these days don't know how good they have it. When I was growing up, you had to make your own sour cream and onion. It didn't come on the chip. No, sir. And sour cream was in short supply because it was so important for the war effort. They used it for tires. You're basically a living bowl of sour cream. And I'm using the word living very generously here. Sour cream and onion are a classic. Easily an S-tier chip. What about salt and vinegar? Salt? Don't all potato chips have salt? The salt is for the vinegar, not for the chip. They all have salt. Why would the vinegar need salt? Joe, your IQ is simply not high enough to comprehend potato chip flavors. How the fuck do you manage to run the country? I usually let other people handle that boring shit. Usually I just hop on Discord and play Valorant. I knew it. The salt and vinegar are an excellent combo, Joe, just like we were. I'll put it in tier A. You two jackasses were a horrible combo. Oh, yeah? How are you and Pence getting along these days? It's on site with that gray-haired robot. Yeah, exactly. Anyway, how do we feel about dill pickle? I think if they stopped making it, we'd be in a real pickle. Am I right, guys? Joe, that was the worst joke I've ever heard. And I say that as someone who has seen every single Burt Kreischer special... Joe, this is not the time for this. Dill pickle requires serious analysis. Joe's brain requires serious analysis from medical professionals. Dill pickle is great. It reminds me of pickling the harvest with my grandparents down in the cellar. I'll put it into tier A. All right, next is flaming Hot. Those are actually a flavor of Cheetos, not Lay's. Get your act together, Obama. You are a fucking Cheeto. Flamin' Hot is also a flavor of Lay's. You clearly know nothing about potato chips, you fraud. Sorry, I'm too busy doing cool things like golfing to sit around memorizing chip flavors. Golf sucks ass. Okay, you've gone too far now. I know we joke around in these videos, but that's not funny at all. I'm not laughing. Don't worry, I like golf. Thank you, Obama. I don't like flaming Hot Lay's though. They can go in C tier. Classic potato is an easy S tier. We can all agree on that one. And back in the day, that was the only flavor. Plus, you would get a toy in the bag, just like with cereal. Of course, this was back when the Irish were still running the potato industry in this country. So the toy was usually just a bottle of whiskey or a rosary. I'm not totally sure about that, but let's just move on to BBQ. Another easy S tier. Nobody knows BBQ better than me, except for maybe Joe, who will be barbecued himself in a cremation facility very, very soon. At least I'm not going to barbecue you in hell like you are. Relax, guys. Yes, BBQ will go in S tier. What about flaming Hot Dill Pickle? What the fuck is that? It sounds like something Joe would probably enjoy shoving up his ass. Yeah, it's going into D tier. I'll teach you a thing or two about ass shoving kid. What the fuck kind of a threat is that? You'll find out soon enough, bitch. Let's just move on. I don't want to move on. I'm kind of worried now. Well, we're moving on anyway. Where are we putting Chesapeake Bay crab spice? That's a flavor of chip. Yes, yes it is. I wouldn't expect poor people like you two to know about it. It's one of the best flavors, actually. What even is crab spice? People with a net worth below a billion don't get to know. These things are totally disgusting. Definitely D tier. You wouldn't understand. You probably know a lot about the other kind of crabs too, Donald. Enjoy prison jackass. Oh yeah, I bet I could still get some tips from Hunter. Anyway, let's move on to cheddar jalapeno. They're probably too spicy for someone as ancient as Joe, but they are in fact pretty good. Too spicy? How about a drone strike on Mar-a-Lago? Would that be too spicy? Joe, please. This is about cheddar jalapeno. What's a cheddar jalapeno? Is that like a jalapeno made of cheese? How do they grow that? Oh, boy. Well, anyway, they're solid, so they can go into B tier. Let's do a superior flavor like honey BBQ. You can't barbecue honey. The bees would be so pissed off. Joe, do you even know what we're talking about here? Of course I do. I've seen Bee Movie many times. We'd probably be better off with a bee in the White House than you. Well, if it was Barry the Bee from Bee Movie, then yes, perhaps we would be. Oh, my God. You guys are too fixated on the honey aspect of this. It's a great flavor, and it can go in tier A. Now, what about adobadas? Adobadas. What in the fuck is that? Adobadas is a red chili sauce with vinegar and oregano. Haven't you ever been to a Mexican restaurant? I enjoy Taco Bell. That is what I will say about that. Some babies were dropped by accident, but you were clearly thrown at a wall, Trump. Holy shit, that was funny, Joe. Don't mock me, Joe. One punch in your life would end. Well, anyway, Adobadas sucks and doesn't even taste like Adobadas. It will go in D tier. What about Sweet Southern Heat BBQ? How many BBQ flavors even are there? Not enough, not nearly enough. Barbecue is one of the many, many things that makes this country great. Barbecue in the South. I was visiting the South last week, the Sweet South. And you know what I saw? Beautiful Americans having barbecue and rolling around in the grass. They were very fat, but that's their right. And that's what people like you two don't understand. Donald, this isn't a campaign stop. We don't need a speech here. Well, you're getting one anyway. What were we talking about again? See, this is why we can't go on long rants. Joe will drift off. Something about bees, I think. Well, anyway, Sweet 
Southern Heat BBQ is really not as good as the other BBQ ones. I'll go with C tier. Let's move on to chili lemon. Why are there so many Mexican flavors? Maybe it's because of Mexico's rich culinary history. The only one with a rich history here is me, and that is because I am very, very rich. Yeah, I get it. I'm sure you do, but you don't get money or bitches. Shut up about bitches and money. You're not a rapper, you're unemployed. And chili lime is pretty good. I'll say B tier. And I would say that lime can go into B tier as well. Limon, what's going on here? You two morons aren't even speaking English anymore. All right, last one is cheddar and sour cream. Is that American enough for you, Donald? Yes, yes, it is. Instant S tier. And if you keep eating them, it'll be an instant trip to the ICU. You spend more time in the ICU than you do in the White House. If people are not subscribing to this, it's because everyone fucking hates you, Joe. Comment what other lays you would rank.